Good morning. I am Devi Sena. In this lecture, we are going to discuss about face locked loop basic PLL operation. This topic is present in the subject linear integrator circuits that is LIC. Face lock loop PLL. A face locked loop or face lock loop is a control system that generates an output signal whose phase is related to the phase of an input signal. A phase lock loop is a feedback system combining a voltage controlled oscillator and a phase detector so connected that the oscillator maintains a constant phase angle relative to a reference signal. Basic PLL operation Figure shows the block diagram of PLL, that is phase lock loop. Here is a representation of the phase lock loop. The input is supplied to the phase detector. The output from the phase detector is supplied to the low pass filter. The output from the low pass filter is supplied to the error amplifier. From the error amplifier, it is supplied to the VCO and the output from the VCO is applied to the phase detector. It consists of phase detector, low pass filter, error amplifier, voltage controlled oscillator that is VCO. The phase detector compares the input frequency with the feedback frequency and generates an output signal which is a function of the difference between the phases of the two input signals. The output signal of the phase detector is a DC voltage. The output of the phase detector is applied to a low pass filter to remove high frequency noise from the DC voltage. The output of the low pass filter without high frequency noise is often referred to as error voltage or control voltage for VCO that is voltage controlled oscillator. When the control voltage is zero, VCO is in free running mode and its output frequency is called as center frequency. The non-zero control voltage results in a shift in the VCO frequency F given by F is equal to F0 plus K of XB capital V sub X C, where K sub X V is the voltage to frequency transfer coefficient of the VCO. The error voltage applied as an input to the VCO forces the VCO to change its output frequency in the direction that reduces the difference between the input frequency and the output frequency of the VCO. This action, commonly known as capturing, continues till the output frequency of the VCO is same as the input signal frequency. Once the two frequencies are same, the circuit is said to be locked. In locked condition, phase detector generates a constant DC level which is required to shift the output frequency of VCO from center frequency to the input frequency. Once locked, PLL tracks the frequency changes of the input signal. Thus, a PLL goes through three states. They are free running state, capture state and phase lock state. Closed loop analysis of PLL. Under locked conditions, a linear relationship can exist between the output voltage of the phase detector and the phase difference between the VCO and the input signal if the latter is small. The nonlinearity of the phase detector makes the PLL nonlinear. Here we assume linear PLL in the lock condition and analyze it using
standard linear feedback concept. Figure shows the block diagram of PLL system. Here is the representation of the PLL system. Where K suffix 5 is the conversion gain of phase detector in Volts per radian. F of S is equal to loop filter transfer function. Capital A, the gain of the amplifier. K suffix V, voltage to frequency transfer coefficient of VCO. The phase of the VCO output actually equal to the time integral of the VCO output frequency. Since omega naught is equal to rate of change of angular displacement d theta of t by dt and thus theta of t is equal to theta of 0 at the time t is equal to 0 plus 0 to t integral omega of naught of t dt. Thus an integration inherently takes place within the PLL. This integration is represented by block 1 by S in the figure. In practice, when the VCO input voltage is 0, the VCO frequency is not 0. The VCO frequency when is called VCO free running frequency or center frequency. The relation between the VCO output frequency omega naught and V suffix F is given by omega naught of T is equal to omega suffix C plus capital A suffix 0 V I of T. The closed loop transfer function for a PLL system shown in figure is given by V suffix F by theta of S is equal to K phi F of S A divided by 1 plus open bracket K phi F of S A into K V by S because this is a closed loop system representation. In this closed loop representation, the Laplace transform of the output by the input is equal to G of S divided by 1 plus G of S H of S. In this diagram, the value of G of S is K, K phi F of S A and the value of H of S is K V divided by S. Therefore, V suffix F by theta S is equal to K phi F of S A divided by 1 plus open bracket K phi F of S A into K suffix P divided by S close the bracket. If we simplify the above equation means we get V suffix F by theta suffix S is equal to S into K phi F of S A divided by S plus open bracket K suffix by K V A into F of S close the bracket. Therefore, V suffix F by omega suffix S is equal to 1 by S into V suffix F divided by theta. So, V suffix F divided by omega suffix S is equal to 1 by S into if you substitute the value of V suffix F by theta suffix S is equal to that is S into K phi F of S A divided by S plus open bracket K phi K suffix V A F of S close the bracket. So the S terms will get cancelled means we get V suffix F divided by omega suffix S is equal to K phi F of S A divided by open bracket S plus open bracket K suffix phi V K suffix V A F of S close the brackets. If loop filter is not used and the value of f of s is equal to 1, then v suffix f divided by omega suffix s is equal to k phi a divided by s plus open bracket k phi kv into capital A close the bracket. That can be represented as k suffix l divided by s plus k suffix l into 1 divided by k suffix v where k suffix l is equal to k suffix phi k suffix v a and it is known as loop bandwidth 
In terms of the loop parameters, k sub x l is simply the product of phase detector gain k phi, VCO transfer coefficient k sub x v, and the electrical gain provided by the amplifier capital A. Thank you very much for listening this lecture. If you like this lecture means kindly share this video to your friends and kindly subscribe this channel.